What's up guys? I am debriding or cutting away the dead tissue from an ulcer on this patient. This patient has diabetes so they can't feel the wound and what you're seeing here is we're removing an eshkar. This can also be called an eshkarectomy where we're taking away the eshkar that's forming on the ulcer. And an eshkar is nothing more than dead accumulated necrotic tissue and by us removing this it allows new healthy tissue to form into the wound and that'll eventually turn into healthy skin. So the patient can't feel this because they have neuropathy and neuropathy is very common in diabetic patients is when the nerves don't work as well. They lose protective sensation. They can't feel pain. They can't feel light touch or sharp dull sensations. So they're not actually feeling anything I'm doing. So why do we cut away this tissue? Well, wounds in these types of patients become chronic and it starts to form dead unhealthy tissue and that stops the good tissue from forming so by us cutting it away it actually speeds up the healing process so that we can get the wound to heal faster so what you're seeing here is we're removing areas of the edges of the skin and uh, some ways that I'll explain this or I've had some of my other colleagues explain it to patients is you're turning a cliff into a beach meaning those edges of skin that are like cliffs we want to bevel and make it like a beach so that that sand runs into the wound and the wounds will then granulate and fill in when those skin edges that you can see me removing are like a cliff it's very hard for those skin cells to migrate across the wound bed to form healthy epithelial or skin tissue and you're probably wondering what is that blue dot or lightning bolt on the side that is a reference point so when our staff uses a camera to take a picture it automatically measures it 